Folks, in my last video about quantum penny stocks, I broke down four companies trading under $5 that I genuinely believe could see substantial gains, and you guys absolutely loved that video, making it one of the most viewed videos on my entire channel, forcing me to make another part of it. So in this video, I'm going to break down four more quantum-focused penny stocks trading under or near $5 range that I believe could deliver serious upside if the quantum revolution continues accelerating. These are early-stage companies, which means the risk is higher, but the potential reward can be just as big if they execute their vision. So if you want to position yourself early in companies that could become the next big winners in the AI and quantum space, make sure you watch this video till the end. And if you're new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you never miss an update on the hottest opportunities in the market. Let's aim for 1,000 likes on this video so more people can reach and benefit from this info. And remember, folks, this video is for educational purposes only. I am not a financial advisor, and this is not a financial advice. Always do your own research before making any investment decisions. Now let's get into it. The first quantum stock on our list is MicroCloud Hologram Incorporated trading under the ticker symbol HOLO on the NASDAQ, currently priced around $3.10. Even though it trades at a lower price, the company is not just another speculative penny stock trying to ride the hype wave. MicroCloud is a genuine technology developer working on a blend of holographic computing, quantum-enhanced machine learning, and next-generation hardware systems that could fundamentally change how data is processed and visualized. Its core expertise revolves around creating holographic and quantum-inspired imaging systems that amplify how much information can be extracted from incoming sensor data. In simple words, where normal LiDAR might see a rough outline, MicroCloud is working on LiDAR that sees depth, shape, location, motion, and structural detail in a way that mirrors the highly dimensional approach quantum systems use. The company's most impressive breakthrough to date is its proposed Quantum Convolutional Neural Network, or QCNN. Unlike classical CNNS that rely on massive GPU clusters, MicroCloud's QCNN uses both quantum circuits and classical machine learning optimizers to filter and classify data. The model uses eight qubits for encoding input data and four auxiliary qubits that help expand the circuit's expressive power. This gives the system the capability to represent more complex features without needing exponentially more hardware resources. MicroCloud successfully applied this hybrid QCNN model to the MNIST dataset and achieved accuracy that rivals classical CNNs. While achieving similar performance is impressive, the real value lies in what the company believes will happen in the future. Quantum models could eventually outperform classical neural networks using less power, less computational strain, and less physical infrastructure. This breakthrough positions MicroCloud at the forefront of quantum-inspired AI. The company sees applications across multiple industries, not just autonomous driving. In medical imaging, their hybrid quantum classical approach could help identify complex patterns in MRI or CT scans faster and more efficiently. In financial risk modeling, quantum circuits can process large, multidimensional datasets simultaneously, enabling faster predictions and anomaly detection. One reason MicroCloud stands out from other emerging quantum companies is the fact that it actually has strong and growing financials. This is extremely rare for a small-cap tech company in an emerging field. In the first half of 2025, MicroCloud reported operating revenue of 159.60 million renminbi, marking an incredible year-over-year -year increase of 63%. Their trailing 12-month revenue growth reached 37.1%, showing consistent demand for their solutions. In their most recent quarter, the company reported revenue of $22.28 million and an impressive net income of $33.21 million, skyrocketing from the previous quarter's net income of just $7.86 million. This type of explosive bottom-line growth suggests MicroCloud isn't just building futuristic technology. It's already monetizing products and scaling commercial operations effectively. When you combine this financial momentum with the advantage of being in an underserved technological niche, MicroCloud becomes one of the strongest sub-$5 quantum-related stocks in the market. The second quantum stock on our list is BTQ Technologies Corporation, trading under the ticker symbol BTQ on the NASDAQ. Its current trading price recently moved from the sub-$5 range up to around $6.91 following its uplisting and massive surge in investor interest. BTQ is one of the most talked-about small-cap quantum cybersecurity companies of the year, and for good reason. The company operates in a field that is guaranteed to become critical to the future of global security, post-quantum cryptography. The world's entire digital security system is vulnerable to quantum computers. Once scalable quantum hardware arrives, today's encryption could be cracked in seconds. BTQ Technologies aims to build the infrastructure to protect global networks from this inevitable threat. What makes BTQ especially unique 
is the fact that it is one of the first companies to create and demonstrate a fully functional quantum safe version of Bitcoin. They call this Bitcoin Quantum. This version of Bitcoin uses MLDSA signatures, which were standardized by NIST as a quantum resistant cryptographic model. BTQ didn't just build a concept, they successfully demonstrated a real transaction cycle using their quantum safe implementation. This is groundbreaking because it proves that blockchain networks can migrate to quantum safe systems without losing functionality or decentralization. Their next major step is launching a full testnet in the fourth quarter, which could draw enormous attention from the crypto, cybersecurity, and defense sectors. Despite this, BTQ is still a pre-revenue company. Their Q2 sales came in at roughly $47,000, which is significantly lower than the prior year's $65,000. Their net loss widened to roughly $1.4 million, indicating that BTQ is very much still in the early research and development stage. But this is typical for emerging tech companies. Investors in BTQ are not buying today's numbers. They are betting on the future necessity of quantum-proof infrastructure. The company's uplisting to NASDAQ in late September 2025 created a huge spotlight moment. The stock surged more than 281% year-to-date. If BTQ succeeds in becoming a key provider of quantum-safe cryptographic solutions, or if Bitcoin Quantum gains any meaningful adoption, the upside could be enormous. For investors willing to accept volatility in exchange for high potential reward, BTQ stands out as one of the most explosive emerging quantum cybersecurity stocks on the market. The third quantum stock on our list is Quantum Emotion Corporation, trading under the ticker symbol QNCCF on the OTC exchange, currently priced around $1.68. This company is one of the purest quantum cybersecurity plays available in the microcap market. While other companies in the quantum space focus on hardware, computing, or theoretical algorithms, Quantum Emotion focuses on the most foundational aspect of cybersecurity, randomness. Randomness is the backbone of encryption. Every secure system relies on random keys. But the issue is that most modern systems use pseudo-random number generators, mathematical functions that simulate randomness but aren't truly unpredictable. As soon as bad actors can predict your randomness, they can predict your encryption. Quantum Emotion solves this by generating genuine randomness using the quantum tunneling effect. Their QRNG, or Quantum Random Number Generator, uses electron tunneling, a phenomenon where electrons randomly pass through barriers they normally shouldn't be able to cross. Because this randomness is produced by physical quantum mechanics, it is impossible to replicate or predict, even with future quantum computers. Their QRNG also runs at extremely high speeds, reportedly up to 1.8 gigabits per second while being compact enough to integrate into standard CMOS chips. This gives Quantum Emotion an enormous advantage over photonic QRNG systems, which are often too large, too power-heavy, or too complex for mass integration. The company has developed a wide ecosystem around its QRNG technology. Their SentryQ platform is a full end-to-end quantum-safe communication system that combines QRNG with post-quantum cryptography. This system is designed for industries where secure communication is critical government agencies, telecom networks, defense contractors, and financial institutions. Because the stock trades on the OTC, it tends to be more volatile, but OTC listings also give early investors an opportunity to enter before major uplisting or institutional adoption. As quantum threats gain more attention globally, companies offering real quantum-safe solutions, especially hardware-based randomness, are positioned to experience explosive demand. Quantum emotion may be small, but its technology is fundamental to the future of encryption. If the world transitions to quantum-safe infrastructure over the next decade, this company could be one of the biggest beneficiaries. The fourth and final quantum penny stock on our list is Quantum Corporation, trading under the ticker symbol QMCO on the NASDAQ, currently priced around $7.64. While it trades slightly above the traditional $5 penny stock threshold, it still remains within the affordable small cap range and fits the criteria of an early stage opportunity. Unlike the other companies on this list, Quantum Corporation does not directly build quantum computers or quantum algorithms. Instead, it operates the data infrastructure that quantum and AI depend on. This makes it one of the most important but underrated components of the future computing ecosystem. Quantum Corporation specializes in storing, managing, archiving, and analyzing unstructured data. This includes video, image files, sensor data, machine learning datasets, and autonomous driving logs. These datasets are extremely large, extremely complex, and extremely expensive to store. Traditional storage systems cannot handle this kind of workload efficiently, so Quantum Corporation created specialized enterprise-grade storage solutions that offer high-speed access, long-term reliability, and massive scalability. Their portfolio includes file and object storage systems, backup and disaster recovery appliances, media asset management software, cloud analytics tools, and even tape-based archiving solutions.
While tape storage may sound old-fashioned, it is still one of the most reliable and cost-effective long-term data storage methods in the world, especially for petabyte-scale archives. This makes Quantum Corporation a major vendor in industries such as media production, scientific research, aerospace, healthcare systems, and national security. Financially, the company has shown improving performance. This shows that the company is stabilizing, restructuring its costs, and working toward achieving sustainable profitability. What's important here is the long-term direction of the data economy. Every year, the volume of unstructured data doubles. AI models require massive data sets to train. Quantum computers will eventually require vast data sets to operate hybrid quantum classical workflows. All of this requires robust data infrastructure. Quantum Corporation sits at the center of this growing demand. Even if quantum computing hardware takes time to mature, the need for high-performance storage will continue rising steadily. To wrap things up, all four of these companies represent different angles of the quantum revolution. These companies are small, early, and in some cases volatile, but they operate in sectors that are expected to explode as quantum technology becomes mainstream. If you enjoyed this deep breakdown and want more early-stage stock research like this, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and turn on notifications so you never miss future videos. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.